Right, so welcome to uh, just another gameplay footage, this time Mortal Kombat 2 on the Sega Saturn. Um, this is a really good conversion, it, I guess I'm not an expert, but it feels pretty much arcade spot on. Surprisingly, there's not any load times on it as well. It's like straight in the action. You can see you got all the arcade screens. One thing I don't like about it is the soundtrack. If you can hear that now, it loses that, like that Mortal Kombat 2. It's got this don't know, very bassy. Well, you can hear it. It's, it just doesn't sound like Mortal Kombat. And all the stages have got their own, like, I guess, different takes on it. <laughs> I'm not the greatest of Mortal Kombat players, but we will give it. We, I mean, everyone's OG. Scorpion. We'll see how we get on. I do remember the fatalities are really hard to pull off in this. literally have two three seconds to pull off the fatalities um, compared to the modern Mortal Kombat games it's very very tricky I say modern like the PS4 PS5 that Xbox Uh, teleport move. Oh, what was it? Well, oh. I'll just go with a spear for now. never had this version of MK2 back in the day. I was always, um, I mean it was quite a, an older game wasn't it when the Saturn came out. This uh, this version got come out on PlayStation but it was only in Japan, strangely. We were used to the Super Nintendo and Mega Drive versions, which, you know, they're pretty uh, basic compared to this. Some of the voice acting is missing. Scorpion wins, flawless victory, stuff like, you know. Yeah, no 
gerade. Sound effects are so over the top, aren't they? Like, Ow! I'd probably say that, I mean, I, I, mean, I can't, I've never played the PlayStation version, but as the Saturn is the 2D powerhouse, you'd imagine this is the best arcade to home console conversion outside of the kind of more emulated modern day stuff, I guess. Johnny Cage. Always liked him. Seems to have the most personality of the uh, Mortal Kombat characters. Liu Kang, the most difficult character I've always found in these games. Honestly, got to get past her first. See when he continues, I lose. But like loading, sharp and snappy. You compare this to the, not so much the Capcom fighters, but the SNK ones. And you know, you, you, you there. This is the problem with him. He's got that jumping fireball, and there's literally nothing you can do about it. Bloody button. Fight. 
fixing this. There we go. <laughs> the best move in it. Ah, uh, near. Uh, this is too far away. I know how to knock him off. Do that. So apparently they uh, ditched Kano and Sonya. Uh, for the sequel, because they were the least popular characters um, from the first game. That's why they're uh, banged up there. first experience of Mortal Kombat was um, hired the Master System version of it, uh, Mortal Kombat 1. And it's, I mean, obviously today it's pretty basic, but it's not bad, considering it's running on an 8-bit machine. Two punch, uh, sorry, punch and kick. So it's <sighs> ah, come on, <laughs> give me some more bloody time. <laughs> Ten wins in a row. Uh, yeah, we don't need to worry about that.
I just love the aesthetic of this stage, the dragons in the background. It's a much darker game than the first one I found. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Yeah, it's a much darker game, like in tone. I think the third one is even more darker because it's set in Earth. It's like, obviously, it's apocalyptic, isn't it? So, in the settings, I have just turned his morphine ability off because you can be here all day, otherwise, while he decides what character he wants to be. You know, the famous uh, Mega CD version of it, which uh, loads mid round my ass kicked there Ugh. <laughs> oh these things gonna be flawless finish him You can tell the sound effects are just slightly off then. We will actually go with Liu Kang. Too busy dicking out, trying trying to get his moves out. Rather than actually concentrating on the fight. Ah, we stick with Scorpion. Fatality. So it feels like because he hasn't got the sound effects, it just feels a bit um, lacking a little bit in certain things. Gameplay wise, it's spawn. Surprisingly quite expensive now as well on Saturn. This is hanging around the 50 to 70 pound mark. Yeah, this guy, the difficulty's gone up a level here. Yeah. Oh, same fatality. Third time. Right, I'm going to do one more round, and if we don't do it, then you can go and do one. I'll stick with Scorpion again.
So how does it, how does it, how does he, literally as soon as you throw the spear, obviously not that time, all that time, oh we got him, there we go. Another round. Let's just try spamming him. So, you know, got past him. Not through uh, skillful means, I would uh, add. So this guy can be pretty easy, or he can be an absolute nightmare. Size of the sprite on that, that looks awesome, doesn't it? so much of your health away. <laughs> it's normally uppercuts you when he blocks you. I my seat from near that squeaking in the background. This is one easy. Close, but no cigar. <laughs> it's a shame you never could uh, control those like these characters back then. I know you could do in more combat trilogy, but. That is a very expensive game. What's that going for? 250, 300 pounds? Get a PlayStation version. I think it's like 20 quid, isn't it? Doing all right there until he caught us. Us, me. <laughs> oh, some screen shaking that. Let's 
so that, that the the high kick seems to be the most effective way to just try and do him but it does leave you open Oh, for God's sake. As soon as you do the spear, he's got a fireball, and it takes like a third of your energy down. <sighs> Come on, Scorpion. Let's do him. Nah, you ain't going to do him now, son. do one more um, and if it has, doesn't happen then it's going off So overpowered, and your hits just do. It's like scratching him. <laughs> Alright, guys, we will leave it at that. Mortal Kombat 2, Sega Saturn. Excellent conversion very hard though even and easy so we'll do that game over until next time bye bye